Hi everyone, happy Wednesday. Hope you're alright, you've had a nice day. Cheers. I've got me a coffee, no energy dr dr <laughs> No energy drink today, alright? Raining it in a bit, you know, because I can feel myself having one, you know, more than twice a day. So <laughs> I'm in my bedroom, right? It is a shit hole, okay? I know I say that every time, alright? It did get better, and now it's worse because we're having a massive clear out, okay? There's boxes everywhere, there's clothes everywhere, there's Mason's laptop that he got for Christmas, which randomly won't come on. Can you hear my music? Is that too loud? I'm listening to The Offspring. The kids aren't all right, okay? I'm in that kind of mood, all right? It's been my playlist all day. Is it too loud? I don't know. Maybe. I'll turn it down a notch. I reckon it spilt something on it, but there's no water damage, but I reckon something like that, you know, and it's just randomly, like, not turned on. But, um, you know, I'm going to try and get that fixed. But, yeah, my room is trashed. I've got a 50-inch TV here. I'm giving it away, you know, because if I could give it away... On ER, I would, honestly, but I've decided I don't want to tell you in my bedroom. Just don't watch it, so I'm like, right, get rid. It's just so big, like, for the room. Do you know what I mean? And obviously, I'm not going to put it in the kids' room. They've got the right size for their size room as well. You know, I don't want to, like, damage their eyes. But, yeah, I just thought, fuck it. Anyway, let me have a drink. I've also got a bit of a uh, Greek yoghurt down my top. All right, don't mind that. Okay, you can't even see it actually that's not bad but yeah I spilt it i thought you know what i can't be asked to change my top can't get on top of the washing so i ain't gonna change it again but, you know i'm just <laughs> me washing the fucking laundrette oh it's like the laundrette the other night <sighs> back to my car you know it's a bit comfier then i thought right i can pop back in the laundrette couldn't be asked going home you know it was on a 50 minute cycle i thought i had a good parking spot you see you go out of someone's in you know and it's on a main road and it's just like the parking bays and I thought, right, if I go home, but it were a fucking performance sat there, you know, I've read every bit of my manual in the car. <laughs> you know, I'm listening to the radio, all the all the different radio stations I'm flicking through, you know, then wandering back in and checking me washing. Also as well, while we're here, this, all right, Steve don't want it. It's brand new in the wrapper, so it's got all the shiny wrapper on still, not been opened. You know, it's got a, bit of, you know, a few scratches on the um, wrapper, but it's a beard kit. So, yeah, it's about 20 quid online. You get beard oil, beard wash, beard balm and beard conditioner. So I'm going to give it away. So I'll do it in a few days. Put a load of chocolate with it as well. So, yeah, this is a beard kit. There's a few signs of, um, you know, scratches and stuff. But, you know, you still get it as a gift or keep it for yourself, you know. So, yeah, I'll put chocolate with it. It's a beard kit. Just put done at the end of your comment, honestly. Like, you ain't got to do oats now, there. You know, I'd appreciate it if you, if you, if you're subscribed to my channel. That would mean a lot. But yeah, I'm just trying to like declutter my house. And then I've just had a parcel. So I bought this on eBay, 61p, including free delivery. This is a vanilla wax melt, and it smells really nice. So this is by Aroma Naturals Wax Melts. You can find them on Instagram, Etsy, Shopify, and TikTok. So yeah, I just bought this, 61p. I won it on um, eBay. Honestly, a little, you know, snap bar like that it smells really nice. So, I, you know, I love vanilla. So I was typing in um, vanilla wax melts with free postage. So, yeah, through the packaging you can smell it. Oh, oh, fucking hell, I broke it. I can't get in. Hang on. Oh, yeah, that's really nice. Just what I wanted. All that upstairs is put on in my bedroom tonight. You know, because I'm clearing it out, I'm going to get a good over soon. But, um, yeah, I'm going to get on with it now. So, yeah, if you do want to stick around, really appreciate it. If you left a like and subscribe to my channel. Like I said, I'm trying to get to 25,000 by Christmas. Um, so, yeah, I'd appreciate it if you are new here. And you like my content, you like me, you know, and stuck around, you know. But, yeah, that beard kit, just put done at the end of your comment. I'll just do it in a couple of days, you know, send it out in a post and that. So... Yeah, right. Anyway, I feel like it's really dark. Is that too dark? Oh, that's quite nice, that. Should I stick with that? Right, we'll stick with that. That's quite nice. You know, a bit mellow, that. Anyway, I've got two bags, so I'll show you them now. Listen, <gasps> let me show you this. All right. I don't know whether to use it for my wax melts or my tea lights. That's kind of the thinking, and I'll have it, like, all year round, you know, with my tea lights and or whatever I use it for skeleton jar 
school jar. So look, look at that. Three quid that was. It's got a nice wooden lid. Honestly, it's gorgeous. So like I could put me wax melts in. I think it'll be better with tea lights, you know, if I just place them in nicely. I don't know who I think I am. Alright, who is she? But I really like that and it's you can use it all year round. To look at it, it looks like it's from TK Maxx. You know, you can have it up all year round. Three quid, bargain, you know, glass. Listen, all right, there's this farm shop near us. Well, it's a bit further out, not too far. And they've got all different kinds of funk. I've been before, all different kinds of funky pumpkins and squash and all sorts. So I'm going to be going and getting some, you know, and trying to do a bit of a display, honestly. And they range from 50p to... Um, I don't think I've got a photo. No, I won't bore you with that. But yeah, they've you know got all funky ones, like different sizes, different colours, amazing. And then I got um, this like Halloween-y decoration, um, crime scene police tape, caution tape. So I got that, you know, these, Steve have got. So I love mine so much and he's always wanting Crocs. So you just seen these and he's like, you know what, fuck it, I'll get some, they're four quid. But they are massive. So these are a size 11 and these are size 10. But you don't care. Pick these up. They were a quid. So you get seven in there. And then... You don't. No, you don't. I knew this would be five. Five. I've always thought you get seven because it says seven days. But it's not. It's not seven days. They last seven days. Do they? Well, anyway, I always used to think you get seven. And then I got some Biscoff spread as well. The kids really like that. Tyler loves these in his pack up. So I've got the last few that were there. Is there another one? I got these. He likes them in his pack up. They were a quid. Down Lidl. Fucking two ninety nine. They got marinated beef, marinated beef, silver side, air dried and sliced. It says so. Yeah, grab them. And then I got some Kellogg's uh, Nutri-Grain bra Bras. <laughs> I don't get any Nutri-Grain Bras. Nutri... It's fucking godful, this is, I tell you. Nutri-Grain... Just... Nutri-Grain bra bra Bars. And then, right, listen, this ain't going to be for everyone. Mackerel in brine, okay? Taste of the ocean. So I really like mackerel in a tin, and I've not seen it in a big tin like this. So each to their own. All right. I quite like it. On to this bag. This is my last bag. So what else did I get? I got some uh, pork, what do you call them? Pork crackling um, bags. Kids like them and all. So, yeah, they're five for a pound. And then some dog bags that have been opened for the dogs to go on their walk. I'm not usually a fan of these, right? But they are good for dusting. So they were a pound for four? Pound for four. So they are microfiber cloths. So I thought, right, I'll get some of them. So yeah, use wet or dry. You know, just for a bit of dusting. And then, listen, I have got a kebab in here. All right, I've got three. Okay, I'm a slut for a kebab every so often. All right, not so much now. You know, on the right night it could be though. So, listen, 63p. Microwave it for 60 seconds. It sounds fucking horrific, doesn't it? But I bet it's nice. But I thought, you know, even just in the freezer, you know, just... I'm not going to open it, but I am curious as to what this kebab looks like. Anyway, it looks kebabber, you know. I've had a few kebabs in my time and I just thought, fuck it, all right. Stick them in the freezer. Got another charger because I go through these like you wouldn't believe, honestly. £1.50. <sighs> Stick these in the drawers I do, the kids' bedroom drawers. So, yeah, I've got an order with their drawers. So it goes underwear school uniform 
at the top there's two like small ones at the top on each of the drawers and then it's i have to have this order because it all kicks off when we're trying to find somewhere and nobody can find out there's washing everywhere all right so yeah it's underwear school uniform tops hoodies and jumpers trousers and pajamas and misc Mis 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 miscellaneous miscellaneous is that is that the word you know halloween stuff and that kind of thing random dinosaur ones is but yeah i have to stick these in so i love these all right the cheap ones from tesco just don't cut it like they're about 10p cheaper you might as well get these i got these from poundland two quid honestly just, oh they smell so nice they really do let me have a swig of my coffee honestly they're gorgeous does anyone else do that i realize i do this i don't fully hold my drink like that and when i'm like doing my face like there's i do something weird with my hand i notice this when i do my makeup like one of my fingers ain't in use you know anyway right last few bits oh i've got another one and then somebody recommended this. I can't remember who. But I think a few people might have actually. But I've been having a few headaches. And sometimes I honestly I could just cry. It puts me in a right mood. So this is Head Soothe. Is this what was recommended? Well, anyway, this was a quid. And you apply it to your forehead. So I thought, right, we'll give that a go. Because, you know, fuck it. Oh, I've got another wax melt. So... This is uh, coconut rice cream. Let me open it. Is that what it says? Cocon yeah, coconut rice cream. Oh my God. It does smell nice. Oh, that is gorgeous. I'm after off that one in my room. That's really nice. That was £1.50. And then... Listen, I've got some senna, all right, because I'm a bit blocked up, okay? I won't lie to you, I'm struggling, all right? I sat on the toilet. Oh, just, you don't need to know this. <laughs> you don't need to know, I won't go there. I won't go there, but I'm a bit, I'm a bit blocked up, all right? And I just need a bit of relief, okay? I'll be popping two of them very soon. And then toothbrushes. So, yeah, regularly, regularly, regularly change the toothbrushes. Um, some bleach spray. And last but not least. Well, I, don't, I never say that, last but not least, do I? That felt weird. Last but not least. What does that even mean? Last but not least. What does that mean? Like, it's the last item but it's not the least. Last but not least. Now it just sounds silly. Last but not least, we have. That don't make sense now. Anyway, oh, I love orange and I love dye. So I thought, right, I'll get them two quid. You know, stick them individually. These would actually be quite good. Yeah, it feels quite heavy, you know. Like quite full these would be good in halloween i don't know how to do halloween sweets this year because we have so many people come round. end up getting kids till like 10 o'clock at night and quite often you know you run out of sweets so i just don't know how to do it like maybe just like a few boxes of celebrations two for seven at tesco on club card or four could get four i feel like the bags of lollies and stuff you get that you don't actually get that much you know and yeah i don't know i want to do it like the most cost effective way but um yeah maybe but um that is the end of the video like i said i really appreciate it if you left a like and subscribe to my channel if you do want to enter for this it is brand new like i said there's a few marks from storage and stuff but it is brand new in the plastic wrapper so yeah this is a beard kit with chocolate i might even throw you in a bag of dimes all right but um yeah just put it down at the end of your comment i'll just do it in a couple of days i know they're probably not like the most exciting giveaways little ones like hair extensions and that and stuff but um yeah if you do want to enter it just put um done at the end of your comment normal comment and stuff but um yeah i'm gonna go now so i don't know tea lights i think tea lights i think melts i've got quite a few melts so the melts might just not fit but yeah i love this honestly 
So um, yeah, I'm gonna go now. As always, my friends, don't let any dickheads get you down where we are, all right? You're absolutely fucking amazing, okay? No, you're worth, I love you, and I'll see you in tomorrow's video.